What's going on, you rat bastards? This is Eric Johnson. I'm a BM. Kevin Raymond, we're back again. Yeah, you got this douche canoe and that douche canoe, and this is the... And then the biggest douche canoe of all. He's no. calling the douche yard. And the, and the best in the world at what I do. Yeah. And what is it? And what is so it? run your mouth about things you don't know nothing about. Copy that, Captain. Uh, exactly. Now. <laughs> thanks for agreeing. Thanks for agreeing. We have Rio and Rachel Ellering. An actual, about that good heat, decent wrestling. Rio defeated Rachel Ellering in 1232. Too bad the crowd hates Rachel like Ellering. Suplex. And Rachel Ellering got a lot of heat. So, Not either. Boo, you're a woman. Boo, women suck. Except for Britt Baker and Riho. Wait, Britt Baker's a woman? <laughs> fucking. I know, I remember every woman we put out, like the first fucking shows were like, Boo, women suck. It's like, then why are you cheering Riho? Come on, she's like a kid. She's, she's a child. She's an adult. Well, that's she's an adult. looks like she's 12. Anyway. 43. Rachel Ellerin got a nice, great gimmick. Gimmick's good, but fuck that shit. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. All right, I was about to say, what the hell's going on? All right, let, let's. All right, let's make sure OBS is still recording this and not just recording. What the hell was that? All right. Okay, I can see Goku, the background. Okay, Goku got scary. real. Go got real mad that that Riho went over. It did. Oh, there you go. There you go, 67 angle between Bully Ray and Heath Slater. This angle got the crowd. Two debuts in one segment. Heath so Heath Slater comes out, he's like, yeah, I need a match because I got five. Bully Ray already kids. debuted. Clearly why he doesn't have a gimmick performance there. He's already debuted. Uh, okay, Bully Ray, sorry, we have a new, new debut, and that's why the crowd got hotter. So Bully Ray, he's like, hey, I want a match. Heath Slayer comes out. He's like, okay, I got fired. and I, I got fired. Him. I'm definitely doing don't. this because I got to feed my kids. Okay. And I got a 67. And everyone goes, kids, 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 kids. Hey, they like Heath Slater. So Heath Slater. Fantastic heat and great wrestling. Bully Ray defeated Heath Slater in 1359. His name really should not be Heath Slater because we'll get sued, but that's okay. What was that? I said his name should not be Heath Slater because that's a WWE gimmick. All right. So his own dad's going to sue him. That'll be fun. And his sister. That's right. There you go. Sonya Deville defeated Big Swole in a 49 match. Deville had a 50. They like Big Swole. They like both of them. Hey, there it's you go. Because they, it's because I think they're men. <laughs> Especially they're like 49. It's like, yeah, it's just men. Yeah, they're Sonya's wearing. definitely getting a uh, push. They're like, oh, yeah, it's just men wearing lingerie. We support gay rights. It's like, wait, are those women? Wait, no, no, no. Boo. <laughs> And the Coffee Brothers. Oh, they don't like Kenny. They still don't like Kenny, but they don't mind the other member of the Spirit Squad. They, they love Mike Mondo, but they hate Kenny Doan. They, they boo Kenny because they boo they boo Kenny because he looks like a so like boo you're a woman, man. You can't convince us. The you Coffee Brothers us. are kicking ass. Do you see that? Fifty six and fifty nine. Yes, Kevin. Uh. We have eyes. <laughs> That's why they're getting the belt of Starcade. Hey, I mean, spoilers, Kevin. Wow. I don't care. <laughs> why don't you care? Because you say we don't love them anyway. Might as well act like it. Ah, oh, good point, good point. RVD and Facade. Got a 48. I don't want to keep burying RVD. We're not I going to. Just gonna have him lose that's all his matches. A lot. <laughs> that that that's burying him. As we dig a hole in the backyard. 
We prepare shovel, a tombstone. Here, that says. Here. I want to give RVD some wins. So we're gonna do that. some, some loses, some losses. Okay. <laughs> you know what? We can bring in Sabu, and then they can. Hero Hogan, Sadie Gibbs. So this crowd says, "Fuck Hero Hogan." Boo, women. But they don't. They like Sadie Gibbs. It's good. Boo, it's women for making us feel confusing emotions. They like Sadie Gibbs because, again, they think she's a man just with. You know what, Sadie Gibbs, she wears a mask, but people don't know that she's a woman. Oh, what did that match get? A 60-something. So, yeah, Chris Saban retained. Five. Eric did not tell you. Did I tell who what? You, you didn't tell them who won the match. Chris you didn't tell them anything about the latter end of the matches. You just kind of skipped through them. And what Shane's promo is about. Okay, well, there you go. Ready, ready, ready. Sadie Gibbs defeated Kira Hogan. Chris Saban defeated Trevor Murdoch to retain. Saban. And then, then Shane McMahon just said, hey, we're going to have a world tonight. And we're going to have tag titles. We're going to make our, our tag team division. Shane is having the best match on the roster. Because I want Saban to love us, too. And then we're going to verbally eviscerate our... We're going <laughs> to... Uh, give Heath Slater the okay for actually doing decent. For a good debut, I guess. All right, he's All right, Heath. We actually do care about your kids, unlike some certain beasts. I don't give a shit about your kids. What do you think of that, bitch? I wonder how Saban feels about us. He's, He's not loyal or anything. He's probably like, ah, oh, they give me good money. John C. Oh, 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 what? New Japan! New Japan! New Japan Cena! Or AEW Cena! AEW! 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 Fuck. <laughs> Clearly. <laughs> Imagine. I'm going to go. W. Two point. Wait, yeah. Do you want to work in India? This motherfucker only wants to work. It's. Ask for work in India. Just randomly. No. Are you willing to work in India? I'm not really interested in doing this. Because I don't like the people in India. Wow, John Cena's racist. Nope, he does not want to work anywhere else. Because I'm an American. Fuck. Would you like to be a color guy? No. What about a personality? No. Okay, we want to be a comedy wrestler. No. Okay, how about a high flyer? Could you pull out a 450? Yeah, you think you, think you could do that? No. I want you to be a psychopath. <laughs> He's like, wait, wait, you want me to be a psychopath now? I thought I already was. Saying, telling Nikki Bella, I'll have. First, you know, he, he, he'll go, first of all, I'm a sociopath. What a technician flyer. I'm a technician. I'm a technician striker. Let's stop harassing John Cena for a few seconds to find out about our company. Then we'll get like a strength. You know, I think you should do steroids. Oh, you want me? I mean, I Shane McMahon approaches John Cena about steroids. Fuck. Bray Wyatt and Finn Balor feud. Again. Again? And Again. That is interesting. I wish we could get John Cena. Yeah, maybe we can. Later. Down the line. I hope he doesn't... Right before he retires. Maybe if we move up one more size. I doubt. We're 19, so we're already doing pretty good. Oh, wow, we lost a lot of money from that show. We were at eight, over 80,000. Where are we? I think we are at almost 90,000. No, we weren't. We yeah, look, no, no, look, we're still, we're still positive. 
Yeah, we yeah, were only on. Well, listen, listen, listen to me, listen to me. I looked at the money before we ran that show, okay? It was cost $90,000. Nah. To put up the show, we spent a lot of money. No. So maybe up six thousand. No, it was, not, it was $79,000. No, I literally looked at it. It was over eighty thousand. I know what I saw. A hundred percent saw. Neither of you looked at the money. I did. Go check. Go check again. That's why we have this on recording. We'll, we'll talk about it after. It's probably because Heath Slater costs over a thousand. RVD probably costs over a thousand. Saving costs over a thousand. You that cost over a thousand. Directly. Yeah, then we'd be losing money. It would say we're losing money. Which well, is no, okay. because if we still had six thousand, listen, if we still had six thousand, we're not going to lose that much money. It's just the fact that it costs a lot of money to put on that show. At no point did we go negative, though. Then how would you say we lost money? To put on the show, we had to pay the workers and pay for our production. I'm not really understanding what you're not understanding. It costs money to run a show. We are well, still we made... positive because we didn't drop below the complaint well, we... that we had to run that show. I mean, look, I'm we're saying, making money, we so thousand. we're good. We're, we made more money than we did last month. I'm not saying anything wrong. I'm just saying we make a lot of money, yes. To put on that show, we had to take a... Uh, for the 80,000s, we drop down to 70 over to 70,000 again. That's perfectly fine because we stay above 70,000. Okay, I'm not complaining. I, I'm saying. I, I understand. I understand. We're making money. That's what matters. It means we can yeah. have these guys. And that we're. Oh, he extended his deal. Oh. I wish you went back to New Japan. I, of course, of course that's you United States. Smart. You smart. Oh, wow. So she decided to not go back to Japan and be with her husband. Like she wants to in real life. I mean, why? She just, she's just mm -hmm. going to sign a new WWE. No one's offering Cena a contract yet. Because he's still signed. Yours to know. Yeah, remember, like once, you have, once you have 28 days left, you can offer people contracts. So you imagine, imagine this is just how. Hey, can you make sure everyone's available? Uh, just be sure if the stuff keeps changing on us. No. As we hire new people. No. So what's the next thing we have? Just regular WCW. Dega and Dega again. That was a pointless signing. Could move it to Monday. There's no point. He's not really someone we def desperately need. All right. Oh. So I also do something else. I mean, we don't have to have him on yet. I mean, we can keep him here. It's just we can't use him yet. All right, so can we just end the episode? We got 13 minutes. Yeah, I mean, I don't see why that's a bad thing. Let's just send to the show day, and then we'll call it in case anything interesting pops up. Like John Cena getting a contract from like trip, triple players on John Cena going to CZW. Yeah, that'd be funny as hell. My God, I hit Cena with a light too. Cena versus Nick Gage. Tony Salazar.
Ooh, whoa, what's going on? Eric died. Yeah, he died. Yeah, I figured that was coming. Uh, She's going to pay right. Vincent leaving ROH. Oh. Hey. It's the guy who raped the boys. The what? what? <laughs> oh, yeah, he raped the boys under the ring. It was a joke. Uh, when we went to Ring of Honor one time, uh, the kingdom kept doing random things. And then one time he was hiding under the ring, and the boys were at the side of the ring trying to help out Dalton. And he just drags them under the ring. And we said, everyone started chanting the boys were getting raped. I hope that made it to TV. It did. You just hear rape, rape, rape. <laughs> Fucking TV. <laughs> <laughs> Dude, we were assholes the whole night, just chanting fucking fucked up shit. Uh, this is fucking after great. The, after the show, the camera looks under the Some right random lady got a crack chant started towards the bear's campus. Oh, <laughs> I did, remember? Well, you, no, the lady was like, you guys look like you smoke crack, and you just started, or meth, and you started going, meth, 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 and then the other part. Oh, was, yeah, no, meth, 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 yeah, meth, meth, don't smoke meth. Don't smoke, man. <laughs> oh my god, <laughs> we're assholes. <laughs> yeah, like like at extreme. I believe you guys like the thing at extreme rules. Uh yeah, we, were, yeah, we, 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 all, we also decided to hijack the EC. Yeah, not when I say EC, I guess it's extreme. But no, um, yeah, we also decided to hijack extreme rules. It was like, three, two, one, and... Again, we were drunk. And then remember, then they shut the clock off on us. We got pissed. We'll get the clock back. Get the clock back. We want the clock. We want... Oh, we were just fucking trolling. And it's funny, because Vince McMahon wasn't even in the building that night. And it was Road Dog in control. Of the show, and Road Dog was just pet. Makes me like, upset because Tyson Kid was it, the road agent for that match. Wait, wait, Tyson Kid was the road agent for that match? Yeah, yeah, he was. <laughs> well, I can see that's why Tyson Kid doesn't road agent anymore. He doesn't? Yep. I thought he did. Even joins WWE. Ah! The real champ, the real world champion, joins WWE. I'm the real WWE champion. What? Uh oh, Chris Saban has an offer. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. WWE. Uh oh, uh oh, uh oh. WWE and WWE down. and MLW. Well, well MLW is fine, but we're losing in uh, WWE. So, well, it looks like he's dropping the title, but unfortunately, Murdoch has already lost his rematch. How are we going to explain this? So, we just put it on somebody else that can work? Don't well, let's see what the contract is. Are they offering him the full written? Or are they offering him... Like, yeah, they're going to offer him the full know. written. It's WWE. Yes, but stupider things have happened. Look, even him... This is not... Oh, look, man. Any big Holy company's fuck. exclusive. They're exciting him for a lot, even the merchandise cut. All right, well, we got to put it on somebody, and Brian Coleman Jr. might give his pass a lot thinner than we thought. Watch this. Watch this. Oh, like wait. ROH is, is trying to get a piece of that. Look at that. Whoa. They can offer exclusives now. All right, well, guys, we got to book the next show. Watch. So, WWE, it's like, Dad, Shane goes to Vince. He's like, Dad, why are you signing? Champion. And this is like, this is for breaking my 20 year shame. Yes, you son of a bitch. Yeah, see, we made, didn't make a lot of money last month because we were doing the two shows. We only made $10,000. I mean, as long as we're making what? a profit, I really don't care. What was that? We, we get bigger as we fucking get more popular, so.
No, I was just saying in general. I was like, wow. Once we did the two shows, I mean, we made money. That's what I'm saying. We're making money. It's just, wow, that was not what I was expecting. I expected we made a little more. I was expecting you shut the I, I fuck say up. the only other person we can put it on that we pushed is Brian Pillman Jr. to be the world champ. Uh, we really helped WWE out, so we really, really got him more over. And he's getting signed. Fuck me. Might as well go to WWE and be a child company. It's like as soon as we give Brian Pillman Jr. the thing, Brian Pillman Jr. offered. Fuck. I mean, you know what? Fuck it. We'll just give Brian Pillman Jr. the match. He's supposed to get it at Starcade. He's getting it a month early. Yep. So let's plug that real quick since it's the show to anyway. Let's just get it done. Yeah, we're on 20 minutes. We're fine. Let's get this done and we'll call it after this. And hope he doesn't get... Uh, it's like, wait, what if we get a loyal for us after this show? So we're gonna have Chris Saban actually cut a promo. Like you know how you, you know how ROH let uh, CM Punk do the promo, how he got signed to WWE. Yeah. So we're gonna do that. He said he's gonna be like, I'm putting my title on the line one last time. Now I know what you're thinking. What are you talking about, Chris? Well, I have to make a career advancement. I have to make a, yeah, I have to, I'm going, I've decided to, here, WWE you called me up on the phone the other day. I, I, you see, I, and of course, you know the fans, you know what they're going to say, please don't go, please don't go. Shit like, you see, at 38, you're, you see, at 38 years of age, I haven't made a lot, a lot of progress, and I need, and I need that guarantee when I retire. With the style I wrestle, I'm not going to keep going much longer, which is why I need a career guarantee. It's like seriously, we call the momentum after the show, and it's like Chris Saban is loyal to Shane. Yeah, Chris so Saban will basically yeah, say, Chris Saban will basically say, I've never wrestled in the big leagues. Well, now it's time. Fucking Chris Saban makes heartfelt beat. And that's when, like, uh, that's when, uh, Brian, Brian Pillman accepted the challenge in the main event. Yeah, I kind of want, uh, Brian, Brian Pillman to be, like, a face, too, about it. Yeah, so, after it, he's gonna, he's gonna beat Saban, and him and Saban are gonna, like, He's going to respectfully shake Saban's hand, and Saban's going to go, it's your time now, the Pillman Jr. Like a real goodbye for Saban. He says peace to the crowd, tells uh, Pillman Jr. It's his do the belt justice, stuff like that. Please don't go. Please crowd. don't go. Please don't. It's his curtain call. Uh-huh. Please don't go. Please don't go. I, I, I can imagine it now. Please don't go. Actually, it's like we call up a minute one last time after the show. Just give him a hug. Just say, I'm going to miss you, buddy, after the show, no matter what. That's basically what I'm going to do, yeah. I'm going to miss you, you son of a bitch. Give him a blowjob. Uh, that might happen. That might happen. It's like he becomes loyal after the it's like he becomes loyal after the hug. So Calls like, Vince. What's a blowjob? Yo, uh, Vince, uh, I don't think I can do this now. What? Your son gives a hell of a blowjob, Vince. I don't know. <laughs> Wait a minute. <laughs> so let's push another tag team in space to Coffee no Brothers and Dark Gate. So what other team do we want to push? What the hell is he, uh, uh, what the fuck is he irritated about? I want to know. The fans don't like yeah. me. They think I'm a... I'm not winning. They think I'm a girl. Irritated at being left... Well, you weren't left off the last couple of shows, so eat a dick. Oh, well, you're going to be left off this time since you want to complain. No, you don't want to use the job again and put over the team that's going to face the Coffee Brothers at Starcade. Uh, Brody and Stevens. I thought it should be a hot property. I think that you thought you really wanted to push your dude there. but. All right, okay. And then the team spirit gets 
Beat Let's again. see. Uh, I hope Ricky Starks gets a good rating. I really do. They hate blasted. him. It's like, they uh, trash at him. Ricky Starks base. You got to listen to his promos in NWA. People started shooting at Ricky Starks. <laughs> they start shooting. I flamed at his chest. He ducks in at the last second. He goes. He goes for, he goes for a fourth and splash. Gets shot like mid. Like he's mid like time. he's like they start shooting him. Like what the fuck are you talking about? All right. Um. We should try Viper out tonight to see if our crowd responds. All right. Sonia, Sonia Deville. Sonia Deville will be uh Viper. Nah, come on. Viper's pretty big. Viper's a decently known name, so I don't think it'd be that easy. All right, then. We'll have her beat somebody else. Hmm. Do you want All right, Katrina? This girl, yeah. I like it. She should cut a promo and say, Britt Baker, I'm coming for you. That's Starcade. Square up, bitch, is what she would say. Okay, after the match, she'll cut the promo, right? She's yeah. still not even exhausted yet. Four minutes. You know, she's bad at it. It's something. So she's going to make her attention known. She's here to take over the women's division here. And Britt Baker should be on notice. We should have another men's match. Should we debut Cheeseburger tonight? Yes, debut Cheeseburger. Right meow. After that. Again. And Drew, maybe. I, I, want, I don't want to do too many debuts, but I think I want to get Drew Gulak on the show soon. Yeah, maybe Drew Gulak will be the next one. I like to call him Drew Gulag. Actually, you could change that if you didn't want to get sued, even though that's his name. Is that his real name? Oh, if that's his real name, then fuck it. Yeah. Can't sue us. Yeah, Cheeseburger versus Aaron Stevens. Let Aaron Stevens go over, since he's more established. We haven't had him on in a bit. And put Aaron Stevens over? Yeah. Remember, we're going to eventually have a minor title, so we might as well get some people some wins so we can track who we want to, based on their performance. We're not debuting at any time soon. Tag team titles are the next thing we're worrying about. Then next year, we'll introduce the minor title. When you get on TV, we'll call it our television. Yeah, I guess we'll call it the YouTube championship right now. Well, we're, not, we're not doing it right now, so that's pointless, so... Don't worry about that. I'm just saying, like, in January, because I don't think we'll have TV yet. In January. Well, we, well, if we're just debuting the tag titles in December, I don't want to debut another new title that soon. I want to push a little more. We waited this long for tag titles. Might as well wait a little longer. I guess. Let's do... First of all, I'm not even keeping track of how much time we have booked. 77, 76 minutes, about an hour and 16 minutes. Um, do you want Brett Baker to respond in an or promo on next one? Then, or next show? So, let's, not, let's have another woman or something like that. Do you want Brett Baker to have a match when you attack, sir? It's up to you. Just her and Katarina. Yeah, it's not even a title match. You don't have to make it a title match. Hey, it's non title then. Yeah, that's what I said. Okay, I got it. So then, in the middle of the match, we should have Sonia uh, DeVille come down the ringside. Just stand there, right? Looking posed. Yeah. Like, right, looking at Sonia. 
keeping her eyes on on Britt Baker in this match. Okay. 16. Okay. 13. Okay. Uh, wow, that's... And then after, Sonya and uh, Britt Baker go at it. Oh, Britt. Wait, I just Can't realized... Fight! Can't fight! Wait, 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 wait. Saying Sonya to build go and uh, another woman go at it could mean two things. That's what I mean, man. We got, we, we, we got, we got a cat fight. Now, if it was Sonya Deville and Viper, that would have a totally different. Okay, who the hell are the road agents? Okay, I guess Mikey Whipwreck and Sean Waltman are trying to hold them back. Right. Yeah, but they're, yeah, they're, yeah. They're, it's bullish. They're not touching. And so uh, who are our referees? Hebner, Knox, and Brian Hebner. There we go. We got four people. There we go. We got four people trying to break this up. So. There we go. Sonia tried to fight, but Steph. This should be a let them fight, let them fight kind of deal, right? All right, so how much time do we got left here? Let's see, we got about an hour and a half, hour 36 minutes, and we need to get uh, about at least two hours, which we could run a show. I, I do think Saban and Pillman should go on for a while. Okay. I think that should be... Yeah, the main event should be a sick long match with a slow build. If they hmm. everything if, went to if the they rest. both have high psychology, this would work. So let me. They probably don't. I'm gonna check it before I do it. Uh, Forty-three to nah, nope. Yeah. Okay, we'll just do a we'll just storytelling, I guess, and we'll just do a slow build. That's all we can do. Brian Pillman to be the victor. And then the angle afterwards. Chris Saban is the agent of his own pen. Yeah, Chris Saban can't be the agent of his own match. Why not? Match. Wild brawl, car crash, and mayhem. And don't forget to book the angle afterwards. Where yes. they, Chris says his goodbyes and him and Pillman shake hands and maybe this you know, he could passes be, the maybe, Yeah, maybe this could be a wild brawl. Sure. And then steal the show. What? I think Cheeseburger should knock the time down on this a little bit. I think this show. Fuck it. That way, shape, or form with cheeseburger. Don't run the show yet. Don't forget the angle at the end. Savings goodbye. And Shane should come out and, and you know say goodbye too. Shane, he gets down on his face. I knew that one was coming. I'm gonna say it might be a long time. And then we all my wait. sound disappeared. What the hell just happened? I don't know. It's a hell of a good question, though. All right, let's uh, run it, I guess, right? All my sound disappeared. So he can't hear us, Eric. Unless you um, can. Kevin. I can hear you guys now. Okay. okay cool. Chris Saban makes his heartfelt speech. Four, I have a feeling that'd be like in a hundred in my life, but yeah. Hold on. Okay, I'm gonna get me a water. Water. 
What are you doing, Eric? Stop it. None of that. Shame on you. No shame. No shame. So, so should I tell that to Eric when he... Well, he just moved his mouse unless his dog licked the mouse. No. So um, it's a, I was getting a water in my room, dummy. I can yeah, still so hear you. you. Alright, what'd you think? Say it again, as I forget. What are you doing, Eric? Oh, uh, yeah, what are you doing? Okay, I did hear that. I thought you said something else. Hey, look, we were expecting a... Good one before I find, get a, buy a plane ticket to the Dakotas and strangle him. I yes. mean, I'd welcome it. I'd get off on it. Okay. Probably does. Probably would. Also, I can't then we would probably I, I, uh, technically go to jail for child. Also, attempted. Anyway. And then the Marty Bell and cheerleader Melissa. Okay, good. People like cheerleader Melissa. They don't like Marty Bell, but 42 is what we need. So oh, cheerleader like Melissa and the team, team spirit should team up. That would actually make the most You're sense. Right, that would that actually would be good, huh? Yeah. Yeah, we could actually do that. But you got a forty-two. Then a fifty-two. Ricky Starks had a forty-one. Austin Theory had a sixty-two. Oh, Which is why he'll eventually face Tillman Jr. for the title. Okay, Ricky Starks did get a forty-one, which isn't that bad. Mike Mondo had a pretty had a pretty bad day. They're getting like a forty something. Forty fifty two. And Diablo Carrazzo versus Sonia Deville. Sonia Deville getting a win. That's okay. I'm sure you guys uh, got excited when Sonia Deville dominated uh Deanna Perrazzo, so and then uh Sonny Deville makes her known. She's going after the women's title. It's the arcade. It's that 41. That's good. 41. What a match. 63. The crowd didn't like cheeseburger. Uh, but it got a 63. That's all I care about. You know what? Yeah, that's probably... because... Go ahead. I mean, I mean, I mean, you have to have some respect for this crowd. They just don't want high cholesterol. Yeah, maybe. They're having, match got, they're match got the crowd buzzing still. Dickheads. What's that? It may be dickheads, but they're healthy dickheads. Exactly. Britt Baker and Katarina Waters. They do not like Katarina Wall Waters. Eric died again. But got a, got a 43. And the fighting we got a 46. Cool, cool. Sean Waltman's debuting with a degenerate gag. What was he doing? Like saying, suck it. Break it up and fight. You know what? You know, stop fighting. It sucks my penis. <laughs> Mikey Whipwreck got an evildoer gimmick. No, Sonny Deville goes punch for it, but Sean Walton Pope whips out a, a can of cream, green spray paint and just sprays her in the eyes. No, so, so, what, so hold on, Mikey Whipwreck's an evildoer. What the hell? What the hell is his uh, role in this? <laughs> Mike, Mikey Whipwreck got evildoer. You know what? He's, he's I don't get it. He's just antagonist. Yeah, fight it out. Fight, fight it out. It's like, Mikey, we should probably stop. Like, oh, fine. <laughs> and then Chris there you go. Coleman Jr. at a 63. He, he beat him with a tornado DDT. Hmm. Interesting. It's not the way to go out, but okay. I will say it was off the top rope. Sure. So then, what? I put him all scripted. Well, maybe Shane didn't exactly. He wasn't it comes to sucking. Just, <laughs> just, so he's like, okay, how, how, 
I did it before. It was for saying it was like, okay, come on, just, just let it be natural. And, and the crowd was like, this is oh, this is disgusting. Disgusting. All right, All right keep saving that mouth like hug. Dick. My dick. Chris Saban should be given a blowjob. Yeah. Giving a hug means giving a blowjob. Aaron Stevenson. Then, then, compliment, then compliment on a good performance of the cheek. Was He was very happy. He was very happy. Low job. And and Aaron, that was Aaron Stevens' actual reaction to the Aaron He's like, what? Where's my blow job? He looks. He's so. Good. What? That's like Damian, your shit. Damian Priest's contract was up. Damian Priest is staying with WWE. Is he? Oh, AEW now going after Chris Saban. He's like, hey, we we have Al Shelley. Chris Saban. Let's hear viewer figures. Oh, here it is. Oh, uh, Brock Lesnar is Well, we got another thousand viewers. We're down to 304. To 303. Brock Lesnar is gone from NXT, so let's... Him do. I know. Hey, I, I want to see it real quick. Like what? What, what, what do they have? So event, events and TV. Oh, never mind. Where the hell is like show history? There it is. Brock Lesnar versus Matt. Wait, Brock Lesnar defeated Matt Riddle and Kushida in a cage match. Well, I mean, Matt Riddle finally got his match with Brock Lesnar. It just didn't go his way. Yeah, and also Kushida. Kushida probably got launched. <laughs> yeah. He got hey, we might Riddle. actually be able to, uh... You know what? That's that's an idea for NXT. Get Brock Lesnar to fight Matt Riddle. Hell Yeah. Okay. You, know how he gets, yeah, you know how he gets to Matt Riddle? He fucks up Timothy Thatcher. Cool. There you go. I just gave away a... But doesn't Matt Riddle fight... One of them? Doesn't Matt Riddle fight what? What? Goldberg. He wants to fight... He said he wanted to retire... Brock Lesnar originally, then he hates Goldberg just because him and Goldberg actually got into a confrontation. No, he hated him before that. Yeah, he hated Goldberg far before that. All right, is anyone willing to negotiate with us on TV yet? <laughs> uh, no. Dr. Evil, how about... Hey, we're, we're at a 21. Now. We're in the yellow. We're in New England. Right. So let's, that's what I'm saying. Let's see. Any local... I doubt it. I know, but it's I'm being you. I'm going to be optimistic for a moment. Nope. And then we're going to be. Then we're going to say, "How about shut up?" Nope, nothing yet. Is it would, Dr. Evil? Something Dr. else Evil would have came up here. Doctor Evil. Well, we're getting closer than if we're in the yellow, so that's good. Doctor Evil comes at. How about? How about new? I'm Dr. <laughs> How close are we to getting cable? What are the requirements is my question. Maybe that's it. Maybe we're just not high enough for any of them to want to What the up. hell? And the NFL is on sci-fi? What the fuck? Yeah, yeah, you didn't know about that? Okay, we Science fiction channel. Shows. So wait, what's 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 the lowest commercial one we could get? Well, the lowest free to air. I want to see what we don't match in their uh... NFL.
know. It's, it's, just, it's a dummy. But hey, Eric, you mind checking that real quick for me? How about no? Yeah, what are we I don't know. I'm just trying to progress the our company here. Seeing what the free to air stations are and seeing what their requirements are for broadcasting. I want to know if it's just our popularity that they're not offering us or if it's we don't have the right uh, production value. Free sports. That's just then. Oh, here we go. Okay, the minimum company size is medium. That's not going to be for a while. So, okay, you remember, right. you also have to match production values. So, right. you might be able to be, uh, might be, uh, hold on. USA. Oh, wow, you can do it. Huh. That's like Saturday morning slam, the kids, probably. <laughs> Okay, so let's look at uh, the American shit. Uh, what do we want to look at? Terrestrial free to air? We don't have any of that. Uh, cable free to air? He only programmed in major companies, so I think that's really our problem here. We're not here going to have like a terrestrial channel. commercial, which is basically the free channels. So, which we're not going to be even close to. Let's see what we have to do to uh, let that be a large to be on ABC. So that's what I have. Yeah, see, if, if he, they had a program local stuff, and we probably already had a local TV thing. Uh, so but there aren't any, like, free shit. You know, the tiny companies? Uh, I'm trying to... Fucking like global yeah. access. CW should be in a large. What the fuck? Are all these large? Shouldn't be. There we go. Small. We gotta get the small. High quality industry standard. Uh, minor licensed. And we do not have the popularity requirements. So as soon as we get the small, we have to up our bodies and broadcast quality. And then our music, and then we'll be okay. And we'll be in the southeast for TV. Oh, here we go. The company must have 40 popularity in one region. Huh. Well, son of a bitch. Yeah. Okay, what about um, terrestrial subscription? No. What does it mean? What do you what what is the difference between terrestrial and everything else? And cable? I don't know. Yes. Actually, hold on. Here we go, uh, commercial broadcaster type. Terrestrial broadcasters are the strongest and most desirable. Revenue levels are at the highest here. However, the running costs are the highest. They're the most demanding about quality. Are, are the least patient and are the toughest at negotiations. Cable broadcasters are the middle option. So we are looking at cable, just cable, not terrestrial. So I terrestrial is actually the best. Yes, but we are not the best. We have to go for cable or see if there's more internet. Okay, so that's actually, okay, let's look at cable then. See what we can do for cable. Uh, Access TV. Um, uh, okay. Bravo? Medium size. Which I don't even think. What is the next size we have to be for? Next size. Small. So okay, we're not we're not getting there anytime soon. Done with that. 
Okay, they're owned by somebody else. Go fuck themselves. Uh, I guess ESPN. Gonna be large. Never mind. What is Peachtree TV? That, that's not anything I've ever heard of. Medium? Nope. I've never heard of the damn people. Medium. Who's YouTube America? Here we go. Small. Oh, but you have to have 53 popularity in nine regions. Jesus. So. It makes no yeah. sense. Yeah, so TV is not going to be... We should... What is my combat channel? My combat channel. It's like... So it looks, sounds like MMA. Here we go. It must at least be small. So, oh, here we go. But they're owned oh, by another fuck. media group. Let's just face it. We're not going to be able to get... Are there any other internet things we can get a part of or a subscription service that we can be a part of? Yeah, we could start looking at internet. Internet stuff. Any internet commercial? No. Internet pay-per-view? No. YouTube. On YouTube. Internet subscription? There we go. We can launch an internet subscription. Twitch, 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 hold on. Did that 20 popularity in 11 regions? We're Ooh, close to that. Make it out and start streaming. Yeah, we might be able to go to... Uh, we might be able to get on Twitch. Netflix, what the hell? We can, we can, we can have a Netflix show. Mm -hmm. Yeah, 60 popularity in 18 regions. So we can get on Twitch? What about Hulu? That would be funny. Uh, Hulu Plus. Thirty popularity in nine regions. So we can get Hulu and Twitch. So that'd be our next step. We need to get Hulu and Twitch. Yep. Either Hulu or Twitch. I think Twitch is going to be easier. Mm -hmm. Yeah, you just sign small. Even though you don't sign it, you just make an account and start streaming. I do not know. Okay, let's see. Day zone. Day zone. Yeah, we might. Day zone. Oh, dude. We'll be, we'll be right on there with Bellator. That'd be funny. EDT Universe. Oh, my God. You're on by Noah. Yep. Bleach Report Live. We can be on Bleacher Report live with a very popular. Well, it's just going to be the easiest one that we're going to want to sign with first because it's the easiest to get to. All the other ones want us to have thirty. What did Twitch say? We need twenty. You know what I mean? And Twitch is all over the world, so it would help yeah. us. So we keep YouTube and Twitch. Yeah, yeah, which I think you can also uh, get Twitch North America. So I mean, you can just look at the thing where it says coverage and just scroll. Scroll down that to see where all they reach. Let's actually do anywhere. Oh, we got a lot more now since I did anywhere. Stardom World. That's where Stardom is, which it should be on, you think, New Japan World, but apparently not. Here we go. Twitch, Asia, Mexico, North America, which technically Mexico is in North America. but So once we get the 20 in at least America, can we get the Twitch in the other places too? I assume so. So we'll go on Twitch first. That's the first thing we can do. So we need a there you go. 20 popularity. And, okay, uh, this, this, this is weird. So for North America, you need 20 popularity in 11 regions. For Mexico, you just need 20 popularity in four. And we can go to Mexico for cool. And in Asia, eight regions. All right, so Twitch is the step up we need. And then from YouTube and Twitch, we'll, what is and our, then what after is that, our, we'll get more popular. We can get on something. Yeah. What is our coverage right now? We don't, we don't have any Australia or any India. So what's, uh, what is our ratings in the area so we know how close we are? Apparently, yeah, we Twi apparently, hold on. Apparently, Twitch is not in... Huh. It's not in uh, the UK. It's really weird. Hmm. Strange. Oh, well. That's how we keep well, YouTube. 
we only have 20 popularity in one gym. Yeah, I know, but I mean, in, in terms of where we're all at, I want to know how far we have to go. Quite so a bit. 14, I mean, it 14, shouldn't 12, be. I would, give it about, I would give it about six months till we reach 20s across the board. So we stay on YouTube for another six months, and then boom, we're on Twitch. Yep. Yeah. Dummy, yeah. Yeah. And then hopefully Starcade, because we're paying for some shit, will actually give us a big... Uh, dummy, yeah, yeah. All right, well, let's end the episode, guys. Uh, dummy, screw Lana, yeah, yeah. All right, we'll see you next time.